Grid Saturday, isn't it, Stuart? Yeah. We've just parked our cars outside of the yard. We are walking back to the boat. The girls are scooting so that we can get the bus later to come pick them up. Bit of a faff, but it is what it is. And we're going to move the boat to move. We're moving house. Basically, we're going to be moving house, but a lot. <laughs> But staying in our house. Um, a bit nervous, but very excited. We have no 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 idea where we're going because we don't really know where the moorings are and stuff because we've not really explored the water yet. So. Okay, so this is what we've been living off. This blue cord is what connects us to electricity on the outside. So we're about to, oh god, the girls are just knocking me over. So I'm about to unplug everything. Right, this blue work cord look goes all the way along our boat. This is about to be unplugged. There she is, covered in spiders. Ugh. Ready? Oh, ruining the impact when you can't get it out. Done. No. Wow. No more electric. Yes, Are you ready? Yes. Yeah. All aboard? Yeah. All aboard! <laughs> I don't think that's what you say, is it? Do you say, ahoy there? Ahoy there. Mahartie. Mahartie. Don't put it in. <gasps> that's just started the engine. OMG! Stuart! Are you untying? Oh my god, I feel nervous. Mummy, don't stand on that. You'll fall, will it? It's alright, I'm leaning here. Stu? Stu? You want me to untie? Am I untying as well? I can't hear you. Am I untying as well? I'm just holding it. Daddy's like the captain, he's the boss. He's got no idea what he's doing either, but he sounds assertive and like he knows what he's doing. Huh? So we'll go with it. In a minute. Should we check out the cows? These are the cows that fell in the river. It was a brown one. The brown one I'm hoping will not be near the river because that would be pretty silly. Wooden tit girls. Yeah. Was it that one? No, it was brown. Ow, and he fell over. That would not be good. I don't even know what Daddy wants me to do. What do you think? He might be on his phone. I don't think he's on his phone, baby. Yeah. People are the way. Uh, we're actually moving, girls. Oh. Yeah. Like huh? Like well, we are. So that man's having a way, but he's his hose pipe. <laughs> We're not moving that fast. Huh? Oh my god! Do you know what you're doing? Don't you need to turn a bit? Quite scary that we might crash. Look at this, stunning. Look at this, girls, it's like being in the jungle book. Mm. Having a little snack, a little boating snack, some dry Cheerios. I don't think we are having enough. 
Yeah, but there isn't, there's only enough milk for Dad to have one cup of tea. Because we've unplugged everything, we're not going to have a fridge, our inverter's not come in. I can't remember whether I've explained this. Our inverter will change our 12 volt batteries to 240 volt, which is what our fridge is powered by. Oh, don't drop it in the water, Bizzle, quick! Right, Molly's a bit worried because we're supposed to be looking for a mooring spot and she keeps saying we've not found one yet, but we've only been going for 10 minutes. <laughs> I don't think she realises how slowly we're moving. And that we want to enjoy getting used to the boat and being on the water as well. Oh, it's amazing. I love it already. This is why we did this, girls. Oh, look at that down there. <gasps> Not a soul to be seen. Just beautiful. If anyone is currently doing a boat build and they're feeling stressed out that things aren't happening quickly, just want you to keep watching this bit because this last week has just been like when we were finally put on the water and then this moment right here with this little squidgy face here is why we do it. Gorgeous. Time to be one more, one more. Shine.